Studios in Burbank, California. It's Dick Clark's Live Wednesday. You know, one of the great things about doing a live variety show like this is being able to bring you the brightest and the best new stars there are right now this minute. Now, the fellow you're going to meet is just one of those people. Eleven years ago, he was an exchange student from Korea going to school in Ohio. Today, he is one of the hottest young comics there is. Now, as a matter of fact, NBC has already picked him to do his own variety special. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Johnny Yoon. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I'm a comedian from Korea, and I've been telling American jokes. Tonight, I would like to tell you some of the funniest Korean jokes. <laughs> oh, you've heard that before? I got another one. Actually, I'm, I'm half Korean, half Japanese. They call me Kojep. But I was born in Korea, South. I take no chances. <laughs> How many of you are from Korea? <laughs> it's, not, it's not important. A lot of Koreans are living in America and Washington, D.C. <laughs> and, and I like to make one thing clear that I have nothing to do with the politicians or Reverend Moon. I'm only looking for an ex-GI who still owes my girlfriend five bucks. <laughs> I told that joke on Tonight Show. Johnny Carson's show has such strong impact, I've received over a thousand letters with a five dollars in it. <laughs> Of course, I sent the money to my girlfriend, <laughs> the $5. Actually, I'm a, I'm a country boy. I come from small town. We have a few small towns by the names like Chongju, Paju, Naju, Jinju, Beju, Haju. I come, <laughs> I come from a town that's called Wonju. I'm the only one. <laughs> it's a small town. We have one yellow page. And we live a very primitive life. We eat natural food. My family tried to trace our roots. Found out our ancestors ate them. <laughs> In fact, I'm looking for one of my ancestors. Uncle Ben. <laughs> but somebody told me he got converted. It's all right, as long as I get my rice. I've been eating rice all my life. But in America, people tell me, you are what you eat. What you eat affects your love life. I've got to stop eating minute rice. I'm going to eat wild rice. <laughs> but I want you to know that I'm very happy living in this great country, America. Uh, but there are a few things I don't understand, like uh, women. See, in my opinion, American women are sexier and more beautiful than Oriental men. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Please don't take it seriously. In fact, American women are beautiful and sexy. They're tall, blonde, black, brunettes, redheads, well-endowed. Oriental ladies are petite and also beautiful, but they always walk five feet behind the men. In America, women walk all over you. And I love women walking all over me. Because <laughs> where I come from, we pay a lot of money for it. But most of all, 
I do not understand politics. In America, if you bribe politician, you go to jail. In Korea, if you bribe politician, you go to America. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you.